build bridges between strong views, as I mentioned earlier. And not least, we have seen it as our responsibility in order to forge a deal and also to put the most difficult and sensitive, and sensitive, sensitive issues on the table, questions that have been very divisive. We have uh, pursued a strategy of transparency and inclusiveness towards reaching an operational agreement, an agreement that would provide for urgent action, even as negotiations continue in years to come. I remain deeply convinced that this is what the world expects and what science demands, and I appeal to maintain this vision during these last hours, days. This is the approach we have pursued with increasing intensity the last two years and not least over the last two days. Yesterday, as everybody knows, the COP president announced our intention at that time to provide you with two texts outlining our suggestions and on how to advance consensus building on the work of the two working groups. This, however, proved not to be uh, possible. Um, the conference is now at a critical juncture, and we have now agreed on how to proceed. And now we rely on the willingness of all parties to take that extra step that would enable us to make the deal that is expected of us. Not only among thousands of delegates present in the Bella Center, but also hundreds of thousands of citizens throughout the world that have voiced their concerns with increasing strength in the past weeks. You have all made huge efforts. I believe indeed that we have come a long way in identifying the make or break issues. However, we have also constantly had to address some concerns about the process, slowing down progress on, on substance. And in the next something like 36 hours, we will be joined by the most impressive decision-making power the world has seen in many years. Heads of state and, and government will be able and eager to provide impetus, and I strongly believe that we owe it to ourselves and to all of our constituencies back home to make this conference the turning point that the climate change calls for. And by these few remarks, I will wish all of us um, the very uh, best. And uh, finally, I will now uh, declare this uh, CMP meeting adjourned.